In his first season at Nauset High, Coach Mike Sherman has seen more teaching moments than touchdowns. His curriculum holds the life lesson that one man, one player, one coach can't do it all. They play a too high safety, right? So this one drops and this one rolls up. So it's gonna have to be tight. We have to win tonight. Just to get things going for the team, confidence for the team and for coach too. If we don't owe it to ourselves, we owe it to the coaches. I've never had to wait this long for our first win. One of the seasons I think I learned the most about myself and about my team was my last year in Green Bay. That was our only losing season. When you win in you're on top of the world, you're not challenged to the degree that we've been challenged. I think he's getting used to what he can and cannot do. He's had a heck of a career coaching at uh, Green Bay, Texas A&M, and, and Miami Dolphins, so I think it's, it's definitely been an adjustment for him. But he knows what he's doing, and this is a multi-year build, and uh, we have a young team, so a lot of the lessons these kids are learning. I'm four years old, I'm still learning uh, some of the life lessons from Coach Sherman. And I try to teach the kids everything we do matters. Someday, you refer back to this tough time in high school where you practiced real hard, you gave it everything you had. Boys! When I threw that first touchdown to you, I thought we were going to have a good year, but it's hard. The season has revealed a ray of hope in the connection between quarterback Travis Van Vleck and Sam McGuff, a receiver who's called on to play several roles. Wide receiver, cornerback, punt returner, I'm the PAT kicker, I'm the kicker. Sam and I, when we first got here, kind of butted heads a little bit, but he has really grown up. I'm really proud of the direction he's going right now. Travis and wideout Sam McGuff have carried the Nauset Warriors through a rocky season and forged a connection both on and off the field. It's something that just works out. The two of us passing together, as far as I can throw is as far as he can run. Our play is slice. That's when Sam runs his deep post and we get him over the middle. He'll say it's his job to make me look good. I'll say it's my job to make him look good. That's the only thing we argue about. We gotta win the next four. We will. I don't doubt it. Sam and Travis hope tonight's game against Silver Lake will be a turning point for the team and the duo. Why don't you guys just play your hearts up? I don't care what your job is. Put your heart into it. If you're playing one play, if you're playing 100 plays, put your heart into it and appreciate the fact that you're playing this game. We want to be able to leave that field saying we gave it everything we had. If we do that, we will win this ball game. I don't care how many numbers they have. It doesn't mean anything. I love the guys we got here in this locker room that are gonna go out there and kick their ass. You understand that? Hell yeah! Well, let's go get these guys. As they take the field, the Warriors sense something different in the Cape Cod air. Stop. Okay, here we go. Down seven early, Nauset looks to respond. Sherman's Warriors march down the field and into the end zone. Sam McGuff switches from receiver to kicker and attempts the extra point. We'll go for two after this if we, if we don't make it next time. Good job, fellas. Good job. Good job. Good way, Sam. With the game tied, the Warrior defense tries for a crucial stop. Let's go, team! Watch it. I'm going down. Yeah, I don't need much. We just got to keep him out of the end zone, right? Let's shut their ass down. Unbelievable. Ugh. Trailing again and looking for a spark, Sherman's team doesn't blink. And Travis connects with his favorite receiver, Sam McGuff. Once again, Sam takes it all on himself, following up his touchdown with a pivotal point after attempt. You gotta make this now. Come on now. Good stop. Hey, hey, come here. Very good job. The Nauset D takes a cue from the offense and steps up their game. 
forcing a three and out and putting the ball back in Travis's hands. Sam does it again. Three for three through the uprights. And the Warriors head into halftime like they never have before, in the lead, winning 21 to 14. Do not hold back, let's go all the way. In the red zone, Sherman calls Travis's signature play to his favorite receiver. Black Buck will slice. Moments before the kick, Sherman contemplates taking a timeout to talk to Sam. Let's call a timeout. Whoa, whoa! No, he's, he's seeing fine, he's seeing fine. That. Good job, get in. Okay, we're going for two from now on. Should have stopped. Damn it! Still ahead by 13, all the Warriors need to do is hold on. Time ticking away, it becomes a one-score game. Silver Lake's defense battles the ball back from the Warriors and executes a drive. This is not our strength. Here we go, here we go. With seconds left, down by one, down to their last drive. Van Vleck puts the team on his shoulders, looking to connect on another big play. Okay. The Warriors have time for one final play. Like that, the game is over. For any one player or coach, there is no glory in coming close. For the team, the one point loss only amplifies the hurt. When you invest a lot in something and it doesn't work out the way you want it to, it's supposed to hurt. If you didn't invest anything in this thing, then you just walk away, no big deal. But when you make an investment, and you can't cash in, it hurts. And that's a good thing. Tough one, tough one for the kids. It came down to a mixed extra point by a guy that was playing every play on both sides of the ball and uh, he made the first three, we didn't make the last one. Perseverance is the key to any successful person. If they persevere, they will end up on top. And it may not be this year. That success may be in your life in college or in your professional life later on down the road. But it will be there. Life, like a good offense, only goes forward. For Sherman, even this defeat is a teaching moment. A reminder that, regardless of the team's record, every warrior has wins in their future. Maybe one day we'll be playing in college together.